Hello, my name is Mariusz Warszewski. I am editor of Radiotech.pl web portal. I am here with Winfred Schulz from DMA Association and we are at amazing PMA Expo 2012 exhibition. So, uh, Winfred, thank you so much for taking your time to talk to me. Thank you, Marius, for giving uh, us the opportunity to talk. Could you tell me why PMA Expo event is uh, very important for DMR Association? The PMR Expo used to be an entirely German exhibition. It has transitioned over the past years into a more international event. So we see a lot more international visitors as well as exhibitors coming to the show. DMR by itself is an Etsy standard which is being adopted worldwide. So an international event like this is extremely important for us. 2012 comes to the end. Could you tell me uh, a little bit more about the development through, the, through this year? 2012 for DMR has been an, ex an exceptional, a, a really great year. We have added 14 manufacturers to our list of companies supporting the association and we have seen the first tier 3 interoperability testing in June this year and we're expecting a lot more interoperability testing to take place in the next couple of months. So with that we're showing a lot more a comprehensive total solution. On top of that we now have 12 manufacturers who are um, providing terminals as well as infrastructure equipment and we have five DMR association members who are working on dispatcher solutions supporting our um, application interface development. What is the future for DMR standard? Uh, where is DMR going? So we've had a lot of progress and specification work being done in this year and the most important part actually is around certain specific items that the technical working group has been working on which is uh, namely that we're working on spectrum efficiency for the direct mode operation. We have tackled the topic of encryption, safety of communication, protection against unlawful um, tapping into uh, the communication. We have also had a lot of work being done on text and location services, um, which is very important for some of the applications in terms of protecting the end users, making sure they can be found and then the, the next part is that we have started working on an, on an application interface. So this will enable more application providers to join the community and to uh, further um, enhance the amount of solutions that are available. On top of that, we also work on over-the-air capabilities as well as duplex support full duplex support, which is um, still an issue that we need to um, hammer out and get into the standard. Few people did know the DMR standard just a couple of years ago. And now DMR is established as a leading technology. And could you tell us what is the um, reason of this success? I think it's fairly simple. DMR is very close to the way the analog networks worked. Whether this is what we now call tier one, which is like a walkie-talkie, point-to-point -point communication, or tier two with repeaters, tier three now in trunked versions. So from a, from, a, from a way the network is being organized, it is very similar. It's kind of like the natural successor to analog PMR. And we see a lot of the analog PMR systems aging now dramatically and so there's a lot of need for replacement. So we see a lot of activity that people are looking for something that has good features, fitting very nicely their applications, their requirements, as well as giving them the protection of a digital standard going forward. And at the same time, then DMR offers a doubling in the capacity. So we have more voice channels or more voice and data channels um, in the future. So I think this, the success is rooted in the fact that PMR tends to be a replacement market and it's in the transition from analog to digital and DMR is, is almost like a natural successor to analog PMR solutions. Okay, Winfred, uh, thank you very much for your time. It was really a pleasure talking to you. And for those who are interested in uh, DMR, they should visit the dmrassociation.com website. And once again, enjoy the show and I hope to see you soon.
Thank you, Thank Mario. You Thank you for your for your for the opportunity to talk.